All right, everyone, and this is Doc Williams with uh, the what is this hundred days of no code challenge? So right now we're looking at uh, an update on a project I started last week, and I'm doing this uh, with the tutelage of Node Codeify. So real quick, this was a project we're doing this as a marketplace. The app is called Bpop. Uh, we're working on that, all that kind of good stuff. So today. Last week, we talked about relational uh, databases. Today, we talked about uh, looking at repeating groups and uh, breakdown of messaging. So right here, we, we built out all of the different aspects of what needs to happen with um, agents, athletes, and all those things. A couple of things that we noticed was that I needed to add a couple other fields here. Uh, the last time I talked about adding, you know, what an athlete needed, we had status. Um, but if you look at it, I didn't even put, I said nationality, I didn't say uh, team. So I was going to athletes team I needed. And then uh, that's going to be text create. Um, I needed location. Current location. That's for if they want to search for different deals close to them. And I think I'm going to put that. And then uh, looking uh, types of opportunities. Types of opportunities. And then I'm going to have. Um, I think I'm just going to say, I guess, yes, no, or I can just say opportunities remote, yes, no. And then what I'm going to do is opportunities in person, uh, I'm going to say live events, yes, no. I'm going to say yes, no. Okay, so I had that. And, um, okay, so this helps with the couple different pages. So we had the design, which is the index page. Um, we had the, let's see. Uh, let's see, I'm looking at campaign pages. Maybe? Oh, messaging example. Search. Hmm. Here's the notifications. Yeah, 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 yeah. So right here is notifications. So once you clear that out, you're going to be able to see, okay, uh, the athletes, what are they available for? So this is the brand looking for the athlete or what they could be doing. That's what this section is right here. And then I'm going to clone this page and have this for an opportunity page that can that the um, athlete can search too. So this is for the brand being able to look for athletes and then they can click on the opportunity and then message the person. The other version is um, being able to be an athlete. No, the brand being able to look for specific, specific different athletes. So um, yeah, we did that. Okay, next, next section, we're going to look at messaging. So let's look at an example. We just finished up creating a messaging section, and this is for, I think this is for an example showing it what it would look like um, for on, basically you would only see this section right here if it was a mobile app, right? This is outside the, the projection, so you would have this. This is an example, but we're going to do one for a um, for a full mobile you know version of this, but we went through what need to be happening, the workflow of what's happening when certain things are being clicked on. Oh, one last thing to the login. So what we did was we did the workflow for the login. Basically, login as the person uh, if they're logging in. What we had to do also this is signing up. 
sign up the user. So we've got to add extra sections of what would happen with signing up the user if they're an athlete, brand, or agent, how that changes. So we have that too. So once we get all of those things done, we pretty much have all of the um, UX components, UI components done. Then we've got to add those two things. And then what afterwards, we're going to fetch all the data and look at the workflow. Then we're going to start connecting everything. So we had an example kind of like in Sketch. When you clicked on things, what would it do? We're going to do the same thing with this app. And then after we look at the start connecting, we're going to look at the workflows and the elements and actions. We're going to clean up the messaging, what we need to do. And then uh, from there, we're going to um, we're going to see how well it looks, try to sign in a couple of times, see what happens. And then, uh, and then we go from there. So uh, and let's just preview this thing real quick. Spinning up a version. Boom. Right there, guys. Add some stuff. Add out. So, um, you know, that we're, we're working on things, man. We're working on things. And let me just do mobile. Right? So if it's mobile version, it'll be right there. That's it. All right, guys. So thanks so much for watching so far what we're going to be doing. And we'll see you next time with the next uh, tutorial, to, or not even tutorial, update of what we're doing with Bubble. Talk to you soon.